formerly El Hijo del Fantasma. Now he is Santos Escobar. The leader of Legado del Fantasma, Escobar is a highly dangerous human being. The following contest is a tables match. Making his way to the ring, representing Legado del Fantasma from Mexico City, Mexico. Weighing in at 200 pounds, Santos Escobar. You know, he began his WWE career in a tournament to become Cruiserweight Champion. After he won it, he unmasked and formed Legado del Fantasma. Which was surprising because luchadors protect their mask with their life. Discarding it is disrespectful to lucha tradition. Listen, Escobar is the emperor of lucha libre. He's redefining lucha tradition. He decides what's disrespectful. This superstar possesses the smoothest tope suicida in the business. It hits you like an arrow straight from hell. And he also possesses a phantom driver that will absolutely flatten you. And you know, all powered with bad intentions. Alexander Wolf. And his opponent, representing Imperium from Dresden, Germany, weighing in at 245 pounds, Alexander Wolf. Guys, I admittedly don't know much about Alexander Wolf. Tell me about him. Well, we know Alexander Wolf was formerly a member of Sanity, known for being rather unhinged, but ever since has found an alignment with Walter and Imperium, which has given him more focus and direction in his career. Listen, Cole, you're going to learn all you need to know about Alexander Wolf when the bell rings. There's an extra sense of danger in the air tonight as this tables match gets underway. These matches always seem to bring out a superstar's more brutal tendencies. Escobar on the receiving end. Yeah. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Yeah. Oh, a snap man. Just insulting. And oh hell, my God, what a forearm! Right to the jaw. Powerful suplex to Wolf. Worried look on the face of Escobar. Yeah, Wolf just can't be stopped now. How important is it to soften up your opponent before trying to send them through a table? Oh, it's crucial. A damaged opponent is one that's easy to position and can't fight back when you put your plan in motion. the strikes. Trapped in the corner. Unloading with an uppercut. Neckbreaker. Very nice. And now Wolf has all gears in motion. Santos has to find an opening and respond. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Boom, a forearm smash. Escobar turns it around. Escobar hoping to start a blitz of his own. Take that. What a measure. What now? Oh, stop right there, gut. He's on his heels a bit now. So far, this tables match has been just as brutal as we anticipated. Counters that. Could be what he needed to ignite a rally. Into the ankle breaker. Santos falling victim to an onrush. Yeah, Wolf just can't be stopped now. 
Roman down like being manhandled by a bear. Alexander Wolf. Santos was ready there. I think we're gonna see it! Bloody cross! A oh, reversal catches Santos. He reverses it. Heads out and he has all the time he wants. Alexander Wolf in control here. Uh oh. Uh oh. Huge sit out powerbomb. Escobar's completely out of it. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Oh, targeting the stomach. This can't be how Santos envisioned tonight going. After what we've seen so far, you cannot question the lengths these superstars are willing to go. The limits of physical exhaustion are being surpassed at this point. Driven into the barricade. Oh, they slammed his face right into the barricade. Oh, my God. Oh, and a backbreaker. Right to the spine. Re-enters under the ropes. Uh-oh, he's searching for something. With all this in mind, take it from me. Nothing good ever comes from rearranging furniture. Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? And he's already taken more hits up there than he should have to handle. Oh, oh man. man. That's gonna hurt. Worried look on the face of Escobar. Absolutely, Wolf is breaking his opponent down. He gets back into the ring. He's taking this to the floor now. Oh, propelled into the table. Fishing for something beneath the ring. It's a table. I'm not sure what he's scheming, but it can't be good. Getting back into the ring. He's setting this table up, and guys, someone's about to have a really bad night. He climbs into the ring. He's doing some dangerous redecorating. I think the table really ties it all together. If Wolf is looking for an opportunity to pull a 180, that could be it. Reversal on top of reversal. He's got a plan for that table, and it does not involve a dinner party. Hammerlock sits in, followed by a suplex. He's getting a little batter now. Well, what do you say? I mean, this, this, is, this is amazing. Counter on Wolf. Catches the leg. And responds with a counter. Escobar able to dodge. Oh, Wolf avoids contact. With the loss at the end of the table. I can't begin to imagine what he's got planned here, guys. Maybe it's a yard sale. Able to reverse that one. Good defense. Ka-ching! Step up in Ziguri. Man, this place is 
jumping. I can't begin to imagine what he's got planned here, guys. Maybe it's a Yonsei. He's setting his table up, and guys, someone's about to have a really bad night. Santos envision tonight going. With a loss to the end of the table. And he goes into the ring. He's got a plan for that table, and it does not involve a dinner party. And where does he think he's going? Look, he's just taking the perfect opportunity to regain some composure. some dangerous redecorating. I think the table really ties it all together. Outside the ring now, he has no need to rush. Off the turnbuckles. What's he going to do? Blast off. Timing forearm smash. And he's been concentrated on that area throughout this one. He knows every blow there weakens his opposition more each time. Caught the leg. Screw. Wow, that hurt. Alexander Wolf in control here. Uh oh. Uh oh. Powerball. Wolf might have finished things. This place is going insane. The ground beneath my feet is shaking. I can't begin to imagine what he's got planned here, guys. Maybe it's a Yonsei. That's it. The blood and sweat put into this match. Well worth it. Shed. Perhaps worth it now. Those aches and pains are going to be a reminder of this win for days to come.